concern. Certainly true. Okay, thanks, Miyoshi. Well, during this cold weather season, the city of Palm Springs has partnered with Martha's Village and Kitchen to provide overnight shelter for the homeless. I spoke about the need today with the organization's CEO and president, Sam Hollenbeck. Sam, tell us about the new warming centers in Palm Springs for the homeless. It's, um, it'll actually be a cooling center um, or a cool shelter is what we'll call it. Um, and it's designed to give people some place to get off the streets at night in the cold weather and stay warm and have a comfortable place to sleep for the night. How many people can this accommodate? It can hold 15 people per night, um, first come, first serve. Perfect. And we'll provide um, breakfast and dinner to the people that are staying there. And where is this located? It's located at our access center on um, El Cielo. On El Cielo. Yes, right across from the airport. Sam, let me ask you, why is this so crucial, especially this time of year? This time of year, you know, the cold weather, we all take for granted having a nice warm house and a, a bed to sleep in, blankets to keep you warm. Um, you know, the less fortunate don't have that. They might be sleeping under a bridge. They might be sleeping in the park. And it's been getting cold. So this will get them out of that cold weather, um, keep them comfortable, and hopefully keep them safe. How did this all come about? Um, the city of Palm Springs, um, we're, we're honored and flattered that they've asked us to help them out and run this and, and help the people in need. So the city of Palm Springs contacted us and asked us if we'd be willing to help out. So the city contacted you. I know you said 15 beds. It, I, I hate to say it, but is that enough? It's never enough. You know, it, it, it's what we have available. Um, you know, there's a much bigger need out there. Uh, but we'll just be thankful that we'll be able to help the 15 each night that we can. And how long will this warming shelter be available? Um, we're going to open it up on January 2nd, and it will run through February 28th. Through February 28th. And then if the need continues, do you anticipate keeping it open longer? You know, depending on the weather conditions and what we run into then, um, that'll be something that we will work with Palm Springs with and decide what the, the best course of action is. Do you think that these beds will fill up pretty quickly? Um, we anticipate probably, yes. There's a big need, so we anticipate, just like we see with our warm weather shelter in the summer, um, we anticipate that, yeah, these, these beds will fill up quickly. Anything else, Sam, you would like to say before I let you go? And if people would like more information, what do they need to do? How do they need to contact you? Yeah, first, we'd like to thank Palm Springs for allowing us to help out. Um, like I said, it's a great honor and, and privilege to to help out. Um, and if people have questions, um, they can contact us here in our location in Indio at 347-4741. Um, and that will get you our front desk. If you have any questions, they can point you to the right person to answer it for you. All right, Sam, we appreciate your time. Thanks so much for joining us. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you for your support.